Hi guys, welcome to this session. In this session, we're going to talk about customer list or email list, which we can use inside the Facebook ads account. So we have a feature called in custom audiences, which wherein we can use the customer or email list. So customer list is basically a list of details of our customers, which we have collected over a period of time. People who come to our website and they open an account with us and then do business with us. So their details gets collected with us. So we will have a data of our customers, first name, last name, email address, or maybe over a period of time, we have developed an email list of customers whom we have connected with. So that data can be linked at the backend in Facebook ads account. And now we can target them with our Facebook ads. So this can be a very strong marketing strategy with the help of which we can show ads of our products and services to our people who are a part of our email list or a customer list. So let's have a look at this guys, how we can build it out. In order to have this customer list, there is one specific requirement, which is that we have to go ahead and open a business manager account as well for this. Only then a customer list or an email list can be used. So let's see this guys, how we can set this up. Once we are inside our Facebook ads account, we can go to our audiences segment. And here we can start the whole process of building this out. So Facebook will allow us, to, this can be done under custom audiences. So you can go to custom audiences over here and we can select customer list and then we can go next. So if you have not yet built out or opened your business manager account or Facebook business suite, have, you have not yet created, that needs to be done first and you need to link your Facebook ads account to it. Then only you can move forward. So in my case, I'm able to do that because I have, done that already. So now once you are on this page, it gives you all the information of how we can prepare our customer list. So Facebook gives you a lot of information that uh, they give you a template file template as well to show you how to fill up the details. Okay, what are the filling up guidelines? Okay, what kind of information can we upload like email address, phone number, mobile ad advertiser ID and other stuff as well, first name, surname as well. So these are all the details which you can see. You can download their template as well to understand what all information can you upload in the list, in the sheet, and then upload it back at the, in the system. So after looking at all this data, then we can move forward and we can go next where we can upload this file. The file needs to be in a CSV or a TXT format and you can upload it from here. So let's have a look at this. So in this way, you can upload the file specifically, and then you can go ahead and move forward with it. So now you can see all the data which we have uploaded out here, which showcases here as well. So this is the customer list of people whom a data we have uploaded at the back end, and now we can import and create. So now Facebook will start uploading this at the back end, and your customer list will be created. So you can see now, this is our customer list, which has been created. Now you can go ahead and use this information in any of your campaigns as well. So you, once you're back in your campaigns, you can link it to any campaign as you want. In this particular manner, you can go to the ad set level. Okay, let's have a look at this. So you can go to the ad set level specifically And you can go to the audiences segment. And you can see over here, we will have the option to select the particular customer list. So I can select this out here. So this has been linked to this specific campaign. And then we can move forward and create the whole campaign and create the ads for it. So what will happen is the ads which we will create now will target all these users with their because their names and email addresses have been added. So we can target them with those details. So in this particular way, guys, the email list or a customer list feature is used inside the Facebook ads campaign. I hope this makes sense and you understand this feature and how we can use this in the campaign. Thank you so much, guys, for listening into this session today. And I will see you in the next video.